got a good one for you. Not only did we see the Antarctic anomaly again, but it was followed by a major devastating weather event in another part of Africa. You're looking at video from Algeria right now, which took place yesterday. Wait till you hear this. All right, my friends, welcome back. It is June 5th, 2024. And yesterday, 24 hours ago, we had a small pop-up of the Antarctic anomaly, which proves they have not fixed this yet, but they are able to remove it now because it is gone. It began at 8 a.m. on the 4th, went through the 11th and disappeared by 2 p.m. And it looked exactly like this. The one we saw from May 9th, which could have began around the 6th or 7th, which would be one one month ago to the day moves through 2 p.m. and then 5 p.m. and then I believe by 8 p.m. it is gone. So the same exact thing happened yesterday. We had an Antarctic anomaly and you're not going to believe what happened after that. Within hours of the Antarctic anomaly, we had multiple large earthquakes by some familiar places. Twice already while we've had the anomaly, we've had buoys go off in this area near western Chile. This earthquake, a 5.5, was 19 hours ago. So right after the anomaly, we had a small group of quakes 22 hours ago. So even closer to when the anomaly anomaly went off the Easter Island region, a very important place as far as Earth energy. And then we had just a few hours ago, a 5.5 downgraded from a 5.9 three hours ago by the South Sandwich Islands. And then take a look at this. We had a swarm in South Africa 14 hours ago of multiple 3.0 and 3.2 earthquakes. That's not it. And then five hours ago, a 5.1 in Kakonda, Angolia, also part of Africa. My friends, that is not it. You're not going to believe what just took place in Algeria. This would be the eighth. Yes, the eighth time that we are seeing a devastating weather event in Africa within 24 hours of the Antarctic anomaly. This is the visuals coming from Algeria today. I just posted it on the X account. And if you look here, just in the months of April and May alone, each time we saw the anomaly, it was followed by a devastating weather event, whether it be Africa and also the devastating weather in Brazil. That lined up exactly with the April 25th anomaly. And now we are dealing with one from yesterday causing this insane weather right here in Algeria, which happens to be the exact area that these massive storms will roll off Africa into the Atlantic Ocean by the Cape Verde Islands and then become hurricanes. This is exactly what we've been looking for. These storms to start taking place in Northern Africa. And we are already seeing waves of energy moving in towards the United States and the Gulf. We could see this right here, possibly as early as next week, we could see a significant hurricane within the Gulf. My friends, I I can't stress this enough. This Antarctic anomaly has everything to do with the significant weather going on in Africa and probably a lot more. Time and time again, this thing is lining up exactly with major weather events in the continent of Africa, as well as South America and also the North Atlantic Ocean. Now, we're not allowed to say that we can forecast earthquakes here on X or you get a community note, but if you visualize this, we've seen those pulses come out that look like fingers. They stick out in different directions. Check out this line of earthquakes right here. It almost looks like a perfect line and then we can go up in the other direction and see a perfect line of earthquakes as well. Two hours ago, this was seven hours ago, five hours ago, three hours ago, which kind of gives us that energy line going straight up in this direction. We basically proved that when we had the same situation take place with energy being pushed out to the east towards Australia with a lot of earthquake activity in this area here. My friends, you can almost read this stuff like a book. It is happening again, and we need to get the word out so people know what to expect when these things happen. All right, my friends, keep your eyes on Ventu Sky still. They have not removed these anomalies, and they are still popping up, and they're trying to remove them in real time. It's time to show them what's up, my friends. I appreciate you all. See you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye. Stop right there, my friends. If you have not already, click that subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon. Click all and you will get all notifications from this channel. And trust me, you won't be disappointed.